It is time for Package from China. Welcome to the Wicked Gamer and Collector. Welcome back to the channel. And in today's video, we are going to talk about this 160 in one. I found this one on the Chinese websites again, and uh, yeah, I was thinking, hmm, what is this? Is it special? Is it like magic? So let's find out. 160 in one. I'm guessing these are just Famicom games. Um, the label looks nice. They have been very naughty because they're using the Nintendo decals and. Uh, it looks cool in this blue transparent shell and uh, yeah, let's check out what games are on it and today's video we are going to check it out on the game box because this system does support multi-game cards doom, 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 doom. Ooh. so this is like our typical multi-game card from china even back in the day they are using this layout so this means we're getting the list here and at the back it's loading the game so pressing the a now it's going straight up the point that you're seeing here so this is how all of these yeah multi-game cards working but the one on the 16 in one hmm what kind of games do we have we already have the all the marios here so that's a very pretty awesome thing uh, let's see avenger island one two three four turtles Hmm, let's see what we have more. Double Dragon, all of them. Castle. What is Castle? Ooh. All the, I think this is the Castlevanias. Yes, all the Castlevanias. Rockman, or Mega Man, Gradius. So, one thing is to. One thing is already very clear about this. It got some very good games. The 116 and 1 is a pretty damn awesome collection. What I want to try out, um, let's try Teen Tiny Toons. Can we press both shoulder buttons? Ooh, nice. It also got this extra menu, so we can quick load, quick save, and just restart the system and going back to the main menu, so you don't have to power on and off and the system for going back to the main menu. That is really nice. And the quick load and quick save is also very nice. All right, let's see. Let's try out. Pac-Man. Go and do adjust the volume. Alright, let's see how does it work. Save state. Alright, new one. Alright, yes. Restart. Choose Pac-Man. Go to the load state. Pac-Man. Don't know what's happening here, but yes, we load. Yes. Oh, and indeed, it works just fine. So the save states are working just fine. Let's go back to the main menu. Let's choose another game. Come on, bad boy. Ow. Come on. Come on. Oh, there's a limo. Come on. I want to kick you in the face. Or just kick you in the balls. Come on. Yeah. The sound is a little bit, let's say, not 100% clear. That sounds good, but... Oh, yeah. Getting the hang of it. Come on. Alright, let's try another game. Mm. Love the soundtrack. Played the game a lot as a child. 
a very long time you know. come on got him all right people so for the final conclusion about 160 in one i must say it's a really nice collection of games um it's a little bit of an yeah, the pros and the cons of this, um, the sound is not the best I have here. Um, it's not, I've tried it in my own Game Boy and it's having the same sound issue. Um, I've checked a lot of these cards and I hear always the same. So that, that doesn't matter which card you buy. So you need to consider consider for yourself, 160 in one, is this something I really just want to have? There are a lot of collection out there, even if I'm saying it correctly, the 80 in one, 160 in one, and we even got the 150 in one. And now we have nowadays the combination cards. So yeah, let me know what you think of this. I'd really love to know. I want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell. And see you next time. Bye bye.